The time Michael Jordan's number 23 jersey was stolen. When Michael Jordan made a return back to the NBA after playing a short stint with a double-A affiliate Chicago White Sox baseball team in 1995, everyone remembers when he rocked number 45 for a short period of time, before eventually switching back to his iconic number 23 jersey to finish out his career. But did you know there was another number that he wore that was not 23 or 45? That number was 12. So I'm here to break down how the number 12 ended up on Jordan's back instead of number 23. It was Valentine's Day 1990. The Chicago Bulls were getting ready to play the Orlando Magic, which was Orlando's first year in existence as a franchise, and it was Chicago's last game of an exhausting six game road trip. But as Michael was suiting up, he knew this game would be different. There was no number 23 jersey hanging up in his locker, and it was nowhere in sight. It was reported that his jersey was stolen on game day, and was speculated that it was taken some time during shoot-around hours before the game. And unfortunately, the Bulls staff did not bring an extra 23 jersey, and it was known that Jordan was very superstitious about his jersey, and he was not happy about the situation. So the security that was in the building went on a desperate search to find his jersey that he so cherished. Looking everywhere in the building, even going as far as searching in the crowd full of fans for a number 23 jersey that looked like it would be Jordan's size, but had no success. So with tip-off closely approaching, they had to give up the search for the stolen jersey and he had to suit up with the only backup jersey they had, which was number 12. And also, there was no last name on the back of the jersey, so he had to play the entire game with no 23 or last name. The situation was such a big deal that even the game announcer, during warm-ups and player introductions, had to say, And one guard, 6'6", six, six for North Carolina, number 12, Michael Jordan. Please note that for the Bulls, Michael Jordan is wearing number 12 tonight. The crowd was so electric before the game started that even coach Phil Jackson had to complain to the NBA because it was so loud. But luckily for Jordan and the Bulls, it didn't really matter because he ended the game with nearly 50 points, but the Magic got the win in a close overtime thriller. So I guess stealing Jordan's jersey might have actually helped Orlando get the win. Michael spoke after the game saying, The frustration comes from losing a game that we should have won. I don't give a damn about the way I played. We had our opportunities to win and we should have capitalized on them. Also, he spoke about having to wear a different number, saying, That has never happened to me before. It's pretty irritating because you are so accustomed to certain things and you don't like to have things misplaced. It is still unknown who exactly stole the jersey, but eventually it was found up in the ceiling tiles in the visiting locker room and the Bulls organization said that they never reclaimed the jersey and it looks like this story will forever remain a mystery. So what do you guys think? Do you think the Orlando Magic planned to steal his jersey or was it just a stupid random person? Thanks for watching guys and don't forget to like and subscribe.